Hey guys, it's the Vapor Yankee here. Uh, um, just want to do a review on a new electric cigarette I just got. Um, you know, I started started out with the original 51 Trio back in the day. Uh, helped me quit smoking for a while. Um, just wasn't doing it for me. I had to go on to something a little bigger, something a little better. Um, and back then, they really didn't have a whole lot out there. Uh, my mom came to me couple months ago said she was getting an electric cigarette and I said yeah I've had them in the past they don't work they don't work well she got one and I tried it and they are amazing they're completely different than they used to be um, so of course I went ahead and ordered another one uh, this is now probably my third or fourth cigarette um, it's not really a, a really big one or anything like that it's just a uh, KR808 uh, D1 um, but it works great. Uh, there's a lot of other things out there that uh, that work well too. But for the price, hey, you can't really beat it. I got this for 35 bucks at um, eSig Light USA. You really can't go wrong with that. 35 bucks. Um, even if you bought one every month, it's still cheaper than buying cigarettes. So um, now I've I've been off of cigarettes for about a week. Uh, so I'll just show you how it vapes real quick. Super awesome vapor. Um, the uh, the original cartridges came with like a 16 milligram Marlboro. It just wasn't enough for me. I smoke about a pack, pack and a half a day. I do a lot of driving, so when I'm in the truck, I smoke a lot of cigarettes. Uh, and this thing is awesome. It's harsher than a cigarette. It's um, it's more satisfying than a cigarette. I have actually gone back and smoked one since I've had this, and couldn't even really tell I was smoking a cigarette. Um, Start off with the battery. The battery's uh, 260 ma. Um, it does have a pretty good size hole in the bottom of it. I don't know if you guys can see that. Um, so I'm kind of worried about juice getting down in there. Um, but I did kind of find a little remedy on how to stop that from happening. And I'll show you guys that in maybe one of my other videos. But here's the box comes with. Pretty cool little box. Standard box. Um, I'm not really big into doing unboxing videos because who wants to see me open a box I got in the mail. Um, but here you go. It's obviously packaged nicely, just like all the other ones. Um, it does come with a charger, a plug in the wall charger here with the USB on the side, and then your little USB one here. Uh, the cool thing about these little USB chargers is if you have a cell phone charger for like your car and you just plug it into the cigarette lighter and your uh, your regular cell phone cord plugs into it you can plug this right into it instead of your cell phone cord and plug your cigarette in the car uh... you can also do it in your xbox 360 your playstation anything with usb you can charge it even your plug in the wall phone charger so if you lose this you still can use this and plug it in um, i've also noticed that a lot of gas stations carry a lot of um, similar products uh, like the kits, the, the cigarette kits, are, they're nowhere near as good as this, and they're usually like $60, but you can get like the little charger for $7, I found. Um, I live in New England. Prices are kind of high up here. Um, $7.99 for one of these at the gas station, so I have two chargers now. Um, and it obviously goes together just like that. So the cartridge inside of here, um, or the cartomizer, I should say. I don't really have cartridges anymore. Um, has a pretty good size hole as well uh, for for air draw, but um, like I said, I'm kind of worried about it getting on my battery. And then uh, a tip here: I do have some drip tips coming, which are uh, hopefully going to be here today. Um, but to uh, fill this thing, I use a tattoo needle here, um, and I just burn the needle that goes into your skin off. Um, whatever you do for work, I'm sure you have something small enough that you can fit into the side, into this little hole and pop it out. I just Pop it out just like that. Usually keep it on here because when you put it on the table or something, you can lose it really easily. They roll all over the place. So I'll just take it, put it on the table with that in there. Um, and I've been smoking this one for a while. You can see it's kind of dry inside there. Uh, so then you just take your fluid. Be careful not to get it in that little center hole. Kind of hold it at an angle here. And then just uh, and then just strip your fluid. And like, what I like to do is just touch it on the side of it, so it's guaranteed to, to go down this chamber. Um, I'll probably do a video on how I on how I fill these two. But uh, and then this little cap goes right back on it, just like this. Snaps right on there, and then screw it onto here, just like so. 
Uh, this is the button style. Um, I went out and bought the button style just because I think it produces a little bit more vapor. Uh, seems to work a little bit better uh, than, the, than the inhale ones. But I made a mistake when I ordered my kit and got the automatics. Um, whatever, they still work. I actually gave one to the wife, so she's trying to quit. Pretty good vapor, um, and it tastes good. It tastes great. Uh, the Marlboro blend that, that they that they give you is kind of weak. It's not a really good throat hit, but um, but it works. It tastes good. Um, and like I said, I haven't had a cigarette. If you really rip on one of these things, like you, you're really feeding for a cigarette, don't be afraid to just pick it up, <laughs> smoke the crap out of it till your head's like up here because you got a nicotine buzz. Um, <clears throat> Don't be afraid to do that. Uh, I have to do it every once in a while when I really, really want a cigarette, especially in the mornings when I first wake up. Um, I smoke the crap out of this thing, just going nuts, uh, and it and it makes my cigarette cravings go right away. Um, so yeah, I really do think that this is going to help me get off cigarettes. Um, I haven't bought cigarettes in almost like a week since I've gotten the thing. I've had it for probably about five days, I think, five five or six days. Um, and the battery life on them, you know, 260 bar, it's not that great. Um, thank God I have three of them. Um, just keep them charged. Two chargers, like I said, and I always, when I'm not smoking one, it's either charged on my truck, it's charged on my laptop, it's charged on my PlayStation. Whatever I'm doing, it's charging. Um, in today's lives, everything's USB. So you're surrounded by them when you really come to think about it. You can charge them pretty much anywhere. Um, so again, thanks for watching. Uh, if this video helps, uh, please subscribe. I appreciate it. And don't be afraid to vape these things in public. Vape everywhere, guys. Don't be scared. Have a nice day.